a descendant of Judah through Solomon, son of David. He lived in the village of Nazareth. Around 1 BC, he became betrothed to Mary. As a carpenter, Joseph had his workshop built onto his house, which was near Mary's parents' house. It was in late 1 BC that Mary abruptly went to Judah to visit a cousin and stayed until spring of AD 1. Upon her return, she was discovered to be pregnant, electing to not shame both families by bringing her to Jerusalem in order to perform the Sota ceremony as commanded in Numbers 511 through 31. He considers breaking the legally binding engagement, which would mean that the whole village would be paid back for their contributions to the dowry price. Due to the word of Prince, which is trans related as Archangel Gabriel, he not only marries her, but adopts Yeshua, that is Jesus, as his own son when he is born. On the fourth day of Christ's life, Joseph redeems him as commanded in Numbers 18.15 by paying $31.30 31 .30 in silver. Sometime later, he is commanded by the same prince to flee with the family to Egypt. They bring with them some of the riches that astrologers have brought to them. In Egypt, they migrate from place to place until AD 5. Upon returning to Nazareth, Joseph sees to it that Christ gets a proper education until he graduates at 12 years old. Upon graduation, Christ, like most boys, except for the cream of the crop, who became apprentices to sages and those who became apprentices to other men, learned their father's trade. Take note, the only exception to this rule was Messiah's cousin and those who were also priests, which they would have learned their father's trade, but they would have been consecrated a lot later and taken full office of the priesthood at a later date than their peers who were non-priests. On April 22nd, AD 15, 13, I'm sorry, Joseph finds Christ among the Sahedron after he has been missing for six days. That is three days away from Jerusalem and three days back. Joseph fades from the scriptures after AD 13, the reasons for such being various. On March 19th, at an unknown time, Joseph is given the kiss of death.